Okay, guys, we are back, and we are continuing to look at the brand new animatronics for 2023 from Spirit Halloween for the 2023 Halloween season. Today, we are going to look at, what are we going to look at? Let's look at poor George. A lot of people seem to like this one. So let's see. We're All right, we're on the Spirit website here. Uh, let's go ahead and open up poor George here. Poor George seems to have lost the bottom half of his body. So <laughs> he is four feet tall. Apparently he stands on his hands. That's how it looks here at a glance. Now him we saw in the trailer and he was kind of spinning. So this will be interesting to see exactly what he does, the kinds of things that he says. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the description here first. And the description says, George was a good clown. <laughs> he made the kids laugh, the parents smile, and kept the circus happy. He made the kids laugh, the parents smile. Oh, okay. I think they forgot a comma there. Let's start that over. George was a good clown. He made the kids laugh, the parents smile, comma, and kept the circus happy. There we go. Then a strange thing happened on Halloween. George was performing for tips in the street while the circus was on winter break when an out-of-control cable car careened around the corner and sliced him in half. Amazingly, George's body survived the accident, but his mind became tormented. Instead of jokes and gags, he now stares down passers-by laughing maniacally. But they better not stay too long because poor George will ensure they don't get very far. <laughs> Let's keep on reading. There's a little bit more here, and I usually say you guys can read the rest, but I want to know personally what happens now. After his terrible accident, poor George gained a few more tricks up his sleeve. Put him on display and watch as he terrifies guests with his maniacal laugh and flipping torso that rotates at the shoulders. With poor George on display, you'll have the perfect animatronic to enhance your twisted circus Halloween scene. Wow, that is a tongue twister, and I somehow managed to get through it. So, I don't see anything about him saying any phrases, but I do see right here where it says, Product sounds, screaming and laughter with circus music in the background. Okay, so let's go ahead back up here and let's take a look at some pictures of poor George. Okay, so the first one here is the one that has the background and you can see he's definitely at the circus. What in the world is that in the background there? Like right over here, some kind of a weird green thing. I wonder if that's something that I'm unaware of at the moment, but it's going to show up at Spirit this year. Maybe it's something unannounced, or maybe it's just a prop that they stuck in there to have a background. Anyways, so, <laughs> so poor George, he's wearing his striped shirt, he's perched up on his hands, and he only has half a body. This half of his face is very mean looking. And I say that because I can already see down here in the pictures we're going to see in a minute that he has a big smile. So he must have half a face here and then half a face here on like one head. So let's go ahead and look at the next one here. And there it is. There's the big smile there. So wait a minute. What the heck? Oh, okay. I got it. I got it. I can see at the bottom here where his hands are turned the other direction now. So this is one side of him. And this is the other side. So yes, he does. He has the mean face on this side. And then over here he has the weird happy face with the giant eyes. Um, here's a picture of him upside down. And okay, so you can see the smiley face on this side with him upside down. And oh, no, this one's still up. But You'd see that face on the other side if he was still upside down, if you know what I mean. I'm kind of screwing this up here. So, anyways. <laughs> so, here's a close-up of the smiley face. I wonder why they don't have a close-up of the mean-looking face. Because the only other picture is the one here where they compare him to uh, what would be a six-foot man. And he stands 4.2 feet tall. So, let's go on back up here. Um... We are going to watch a video here. 
All right, I'm anxious to see what this guy does. Well, I mean, I already know what he does. He's going to flip around and make sounds and scream, apparently, but... He reminds me of Lucky Bottoms. <laughs> so, okay, I gotta see that movement one more time. Yeah, so the sound that he's making, the, the maniacal laughing, reminds me of um, Lucky Bottoms, which is weird because he also was missing half his body. Um, but as we're watching here, you can see where he, I was thinking maybe he'd just spin around and around, but he doesn't. He goes this way and then he comes back and he goes this way and he comes back. So um, yeah, his mechanism is not made where he can just simply go around and around like that. Um, he's okay. I mean, I like the maniacal laughing and the sounds in the background. Um, Definitely not my favorite. A lot of people seem to love him from what I'm seeing online already. He, and, and yeah, he's cool, but he's definitely not my favorite. However, I will say this. If you had a circus setup, or, you know, clowns, whatever, however you want to say it, um, it would be cool to have both him and Lucky Bottoms in, like, the same area. So, all right. Well, I guess that's it for poor George. Um, honestly, I'm not really all that impressed by him. I think he's going to be cool to see in the store. It does not say here that he is only sold online. So I think he will be a fun one to see in the store. And especially, just like Lucky Bottoms, uh, when you walk in the store, I expect to be able to hear him laughing maniacally in the background. Like immediately, as soon as you walk in the store. So... All right, guys, there you go. Just a quick look at poor George. Let me know what you guys think about him. He's definitely not my favorite, but he is cool. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing him in the stores. So um, stick around. We still have a handful more of these to do, and we still have a few that they have not put out yet. So as soon as those come out, we'll be getting to those as well.